Hey folks, what's going on? Listen, listen, listen. Uh, I woke up thinking about something similar to this. Had a conversation with some people last week about it. And then a friend sent me something today that kind of highlighted it once again. There is a fundamental difference between healing and symptom relief. Getting over stuff. Fundamental difference. So many people have claimed that they are healed. Oh, I'm healed from that. I'm healed from that. And it could be emotional problems, uh, heartbreak, any type of breach, relational breaches or anything like that. And, and people say, oh, I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed from that. And sometimes you still see an attitude that comes from it. Sometimes you still see um, just some lingering uh, elements that are still kind of, you know, there. And, and, and some of these things comes out immediately. Some of it comes out much later. Um, I've been in situations where I've had the privilege of being able to counsel with some folks and, 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 and some years within their age, you know, and, and thought they were healed over something, you know, and, and the truth came out that for them that they weren't really healed. They just kind of got over it um, or stuffed it in, as we say in grief recovery, say stuffed it in their backpack and, and was just strong regarding the situation and moved on from it or uh, uh, as we famously say, just, you know, I'm over it, got over it. Um, but symptom relief is not the same as truly being healed at a root level. All right. There are some things that we take little doses of medication for that'll heal us or that'll give us the impression of being healed or that'll give us symptom relief, but is not truly going to the root problem and to the root issue and healing that space. One way to recognize that you have not fully been healed from a situation is to look at how you relate after those situations. If you are now super guarded, if you are now uh, having up a whole bunch of walls, I'm not talking about just being wise. All right. Wisdom is a fruit of our spirit, you know, and it's a resilience, you know, but some of us are operating in not it's not really truly wisdom. It's fear or it's um you know, it's, it's this huge guarding or this huge protecting, you know, and, and it hinders in a way our hearts from flowing the way that it should be flowing. All right. Um, if that breach has caused you to no longer flow in the way you normally would flow as a loving being, then there's a high chance that you have not been healed. You've only experienced certain levels of symptom relief and then or buried some of those things. there, So you don't recognize that uh, things are there. So now you've moved on to another relationship or moved on to another situation, or moved on to whatever. Like, oh, I'm over that. You know, but again, we got to watch this and watch our attitudes. And I can't speak directly for each person, you know, how this actually plays out. But I want you to ask yourself the question as because I do believe that healing is extremely important for us. True healing. Um, are you healed? Or did you just get symptom relief? Are you healed? Or did you just get symptom relief? Ponder that. And let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's see what we can do to really get us to a space of being our most essential self. Coming back to our most essential self. Not our traumatized, traumatized self. All right? not, not our breached self. But our essential self. If we haven't returned to our essential self, there's a potential that we haven't been fully healed. Now, that's not a shame. That's not nothing to shame anybody over or to, you know, get deeply depressed over anything like that necessarily. But it is to say, let's shoot for uh, going to that space of actually having root healing and not just symptom relief. I know I'm talking to you. I know I'm talking to you. I know I'm talking to a lot of people because even as I'm looking at this camera, I'm talking to me. All right, so I know we in this boat together, baby. All right, so let's let's do what we can to see and bring forth root healing. And let's be, let's be that healing for one another and support one another in actually achieving that. We can do it. We can really do it. And this is what we're called to do. And this is what we're called to be anyway. So I encourage you to, one, do a, a whole introspection of yourself and to see in the areas where you actually need root healing. And then for you, encourage you also to be support for others that are on this journey. You don't have to have fully made it to be a support for others. And I, I, that's a huge thing that we tend to miss. We think that you have to have arrived in order to be able to be support for others on the same journey. Actually, folks, this is how we grow. This is how we move forward. All right. So are you really healed or did you just get a little bit of symptom relief that may end up coming up later? Anyway, I am love for you and hope that you'll be love for me. Peace.